Hi everyone, welcome back to another Space Engineers tutorial. So, a question I got a while back was, where do I get all the information there is to like make the scripts? And like, how do I know what to call the blocks? Where do I find all this information from? Well, if we go to the script that I made not that long ago, we have things like this here, which is an interface. We have the variable that we're going to create. And then we have this big long string here. So you probably wonder, where did I get that from? Well, the simple answer is, I actually got it from Space Engineers Wiki. So if you go onto the wiki and scroll down, you will see examples of how to write the code. But if you go down halfway through the page, you will find all the objects you need in the game. Now do note, things like the rotating light aren't on this list, as well as some other blocks. But the basic blocks you need, such as the air vent, vents, rotor, pistons, etc. They're all on this list. You've got your buttons, gatling guns, grinders. So whatever you want to program is going to be on that list. And then say for example you want to program, um, I don't know, let's pick one at random, say, let's say the advanced rotor. So we have the thing called the interface name, and the interface name is found on the list. And then you have things called actions, and actions are like, do uh, you know the way whenever you go into the gene menu and you sign your buttons? So like increase velocity, decrease velocity, increase, um, lower limit, decrease lower limit, all that there is in that. And that's where you get it from. There will be a link in the description to that wiki page. And as always, the scripts used in these tutorials is available to see on my website, where you can copy and paste them and change any of the values you want. If you have any suggestions or any questions all relating to the scripts, uh, just stick them in a comment or go out and visit the Discord channel that's linked in the description. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you again in the next scripting tutorial.